If you're a dog lover like me, you're probably wondering, does Vancouver, Washington have any dog parks? Well, let's take a look. Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Denise Gerke, a real estate agent here in Vancouver, Washington with Keller Williams. So I've brought my friend Scrappy here to help us take a look at one of the dog parks in Vancouver. Um, Vancouver is in Clark County and Clark County has four dog parks that, um, that they work with. And this one is the D Dakota Memorial Dog Park and it is named after um, a police dog that um, was shot in the line of duty and I believe that was in 2007. So the four dog parks in Clark County are run um, in conjunction with the dog owners. Oh, I have to look at it. Hold on a second. Dog owners group for park access in Washington, otherwise known as Dog Paws. So that makes it easier. <laughs> so this park, Dakota Memorial, it's um, fully fenced and it is eight it's approximately eight acres. Um, it has a trail that runs all around the perimeter. And if you walk the whole thing, it's approximately um, a half mile long. And as you walk through, you can see behind me, there's open field. Um, and then on this side, you see there's like a little bit of a wooded area. And they have some logs that are kind of like a little agility area for the dogs. There are drinking fountains for both humans and dogs. Um, and of course there's park benches so you can stop and take a break. Um, a lot of people will stop and just, you know, sit on the benches and let their dogs play with each other. And then the Dakota Memorial Dog Park is actually within Pacific Community Park. Um, and it also has a trail that runs um, all around the perimeter and uh, a few that intersect in between. Um, uh, there's baseball fields and skate park and things like that. Uh, but if your dog is out with you in the Pacific Community Park, make sure it's on a leash. It does have to be on a leash for that area. And there are just some basic rules for entering the dog park. So your dog must be licensed in Clark County. and. I've never seen them check for it, uh, but it, if they do check and your dog's not licensed, um, it, it's a $100 fine, I believe, the first time, and it goes up from there if they continue seeing you without your dog licensed. And the second big thing is that you have to scoop the poop. So <laughs> dogs could carry um, worms, bacteria, viruses, and if you don't scoop it, and it rains like it does here, um, then it just, it gets into the ground um, and sometimes dogs are gross and they'll eat it. And your dog, you might not think it's sick, but sometimes dogs can carry these things and they, they don't look like they're sick. So make sure you scoop the poop, it's just polite. And then also, um, no aggressive dogs in the park. Um, I brought Scrappy, he's friendly, he loves everybody. Uh, but my other dog, Maria, she's great at home. All the dogs can come play with her at her house. But if I were to bring her here, it wouldn't work. She's be, I don't know why, but she's just really aggressive um, in a situation like this. So Scrappy comes, Maria stays home. And then any dogs over a year old, they have to be um, neutered or spayed to go into the park. Uh, it helps cut down on aggression and it helps cut down on unwanted puppies. And also dogs that are over a year old need to be current on all vaccines. Uh, because just like we said, um, you can dogs can be sick and not show it. And so we just wanna keep all our pups as healthy as we can. And there are a few more rules, but I will post a link to the dog park's website and you can check out all the rules there. And it'll actually show you a link to the other three parks that are in Clark County as well. 
And one of my favorite things, and I think one of Scrappy's favorite things about this particular park is they have a small dog play area. Sometimes when the big dogs are playing, um, they want to come play with Scrappy as well, but it's just a little too rough for him and he gets scared. So we'll go into the small dog play area that's fenced off and it just uh, it gives him a chance to relax a little bit more. But they also have a small dog play group that meets there most weeknights. It of course depends on the weather and um, how soon it gets dark, but Scrappy loves going to small dog play group where he gets to just run and play with all of his friends. Scrappy's getting a little anxious. He knows we're here to have fun, so we're going to go check out, see if we can find any of his friends in there. Um, but if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Click that little bell so you get reminders every Tuesday when new videos are posted. And I hope you all are having a great day. We'll see you next Tuesday. Bye-bye. <laughs> He's dying. He wants to go play so bad. <laughs>